They practiced in pads both Tuesday and Wednesday, and that's highly unusual for Georgia. Samuel in trouble this time. He got banged down behind 37 straight starts. Dallas Lee's a new starter in left guard for the injured Canarius Gates. Murray dumps it off short for the he had a bad week last week against East Carolina. Spurrier said it was his worst game as a game cop. Murray, yes, was the case last week with him running back. Another one of the most highly recruited players in the country last year. Again, forced to throw it away. Truly. Following blockers around the corner. And another long run by out to tackle this year. Now a senior. Murray out of the gun. High throw over the hips to come. And Murray under center. Starts with a play action pass. Dumped off to the fullback. Figgins moved to fullback this year. He wasn't going to play much at tight end. Richard Samuel tackled with the line. Of Brandon Boykin is on the field. Defensive back. They had an 80 yard touchdown run last week. And the South Carolina 16. Murray in a nice pocket. Throws tip. to Boykin wide open. Nice protection. He's able to see the field, and he's eyeballing it the whole way. And when he eyeballs it, crucial point, and Alshon Jeffrey did just that. And off to Malcolm Mitchell, freshman wide receiver, going across the formation in the game. And their quarterbacks after last year. And off to Richard Samuel. He's 243 pounds. Bouncing on bodies ahead for two. And Blinken on the offense again for Georgia. Lots of time. Going deep. Has a man. This defense has done an excellent job. South Carolina just 125 yards of offense. It's a fake. Executed to perfection by South Carolina. And it's a touchdown. Ingram right there. See him number six. The most impressive part of this runs right through, right over a, a potential tackler, and then right there. That is... You can see he had running back skills in his high school days, and he still has them. There's Brandon Boykin, who was back deep for the punt. And this is a defensive end and defensive tackle, Ingram, who's 276 pounds. Aaron back to pass, just a three-man rush. Locks it up and almost intercepted. Richard Samuel reverses his field. Now there's some running room. Picks up a block from Murray. The First and ten, Georgia down by a point. After the good punt return at the 43 of South Carolina. Screen, Isaiah Crowell. Down to because he's he's in there and he's giving it everything. Nicely done on the front end on Ingram because he has to draw Georgia in field goal range to reclaim the lead, but they'd like seven. He came right back to it, and the whole key is to allow them to come in, which they do. They actually caught him in a in a stunt, and Clowney can't catch. He's still on the field for the offense. We haven't seen Isaiah Crowell in running back since his fumble. Good catch on a hot. Murray on first and ten. Another quick punt. Michael Bennett in the secondary. In the end zone. Touchdown. Carolina rush four. Murray with time. Timeout. South Carolina doesn't have any. Three wide receivers and Murray couldn't even complete his drop. Then he fumbles the football. To Davian Cloudy knocked it loose. And Melvin Ingram has scored again. Touchdown, South Carolina. Knocks the ball out and Ingram just cleans it up. Steps up, runs, stayed in back. Interception return. 
Murray giving time this time. Ducks it short. Crowell dropped it. Murray hooked to his right and threw. Right, ten men up for the Gamecocks. High in the air it goes. And controlled by Melvin Ingram. Been the special team star. I, I would think that he might be the only defensive lineman in the country who's on the hands 